Welcome to Places to Go with Heather Gill. Of course, I'm Heather Gill. I'm on location today with Paul Russo. We're at VentureX in, Ca in Castle Hills here in the Colony, Texas. And this is a beautiful place and a beautiful space to meet people. Oh, it is, it is. It's that initial presentation. There you go. But the most beautiful thing for you golf lovers is that we got some cool golf stuff here. Paul's going to tell us all about it. Paul, thank you so much for letting me interview you today. Well, thanks for asking me. I know we've been trying to get through this for a little while, you know, and uh, we're inside today because the weather's bad, which is perfect introduction for I Putt Better. I love it. Because we have a golf putting trainer. Um, it's made in the USA, invented by a friend of mine named David Grill. I've been looking at it for a couple of years, and it's a game changer. You want to get some strokes off your game and impress your friends? The Delta Putt. So it's called a Delta Putt because we have a Delta triangle instead of a ball. So mm. you don't have to chase it around the house. Right. And you don't have to get it away from your cat. Oh, there you go. And it doesn't break things because you're not going to launch it into the window or, you know, whatever it is that you're going to launch into the wall. You know, this is, so it has, what's really interesting and unique is it has three different training sides. You have an amateur, which is a full size of a golf ball. Okay. You have a pro side, which is just a little less of the golf ball, the profile and a tour. The idea is you got your putter, you got the puck, sweet spot. So if you're open, or if you're closed, it's going to spin left or right. Mm. So the idea is, and we have our greens here, which we'll show in a minute, and you'll see on a couple other segments, is it has a line on it. So you can put straight down the line because a lot of people, when they go out to a putting green, right, they putt, but there's no real direction. It's right. just, can I make it that way to the hole? Right, exactly. So what I talk to people about is practice at home, impress your friends on a day like today. You can practice, there you go. get out tomorrow because it's supposed right. to be nice here in Dallas. All right, tomorrow's a better day. So there you, you go. The and then you'll have better putting practice. You'll take a few strokes off. Okay. If you do that wager thing that they always talk about, mm, it's a way to make <laughs> money. I'm just saying, you know, you got to hit all right. the, you got to hit it all. So now I, I love this concept and it, it's pretty cool in person. Hopefully you can see it on camera well, but it's a cool product. It definitely, I've putted a few times with it and it's pretty neat. I have to confess, I'm the one who usually drives the golf cart around, but like if I was trying to get my game up to the next level, I think this would be the way to go about it. And I love the fact that you can use this at your house. You're not going to have to worry about knocking out one of the kids, killing one of your pets, breaking a window. Right. <laughs> it's it's going to stay on the floor unless you just really get aggressive with it. But right, no, and, I doubt and it. not only can you use it at home, but you can use it anywhere there's right. a flat surface. Right. So. What some of the golfers do is they'll take these smaller versions. So we have two different sizes. They'll take the smaller travel size. And they'll actually take it to the course with them in their bag. Oh. They'll lay it out. Right. They'll hit a couple strokes with this. Then they'll take the ball to the putting green. Right. And they'll go to the driving range. So it's like practicing and warming up. Right. So this would be an additional step. Right. Where you get your stroke. And then when you go to the putting green, you can learn how the putt, how the green's actually going to flow. So Paul, I think you've got a really awesome product here and Thanks. I love how compact it is. And like this fits in a small little box. Tell me how oh, yeah. you see people using this on a case by case basis. I can tell you how we're doing that by who we're working with. Sure. We're working with junior golf academies. Okay. So you have junior, he wants to be PGA player. He's out there. I've taken it to a golf academies and the instructors have been able to use this within a couple minutes with their juniors. Okay and it's priced right mm -hmm. where the parents can afford it to okay. take it home because then they can practice like a violin or any other instrument, okay. right? You need to practice. You take this home in a combo pack or individual and they can practice and practice and right. they practice. And then when they get out there, it'll show within you know 30 or 40 minutes of them okay. actually practicing it and learning their stroke and learning to move pendulum instead of their hips and just right. some of the different things that they learn okay. at their academy. We're working with adults, same thing. Right, right. Because not everyone starts as a small kid golfing. So the adult, there's sure. adult academies. Okay. So the concept is pretty much the same. Even the pros, if you just watch the masters, I was watching some of these guys and they were like getting right there and were just going right around the edge and they're going like, ugh, crushing. Oh, it's all about the practice, right? right? They've been practicing for years and years, right. but they still, there's several PGA players that Dave, the inventor, has that use the product. Okay. It's always about practice. Right. It's, once you stop practicing, you start losing your skill. No, that's true. So individually, it's a great product. Anyone, whether you're a beginner like yourself, so I could set this down and with probably within five or six strokes, you would have the basic idea. Okay. And then you would work on the placement, like I mentioned earlier, of your putt to the, the, right. the device yeah. and in line. So it's, it's a fast learn. Okay. 
It's an easy learn. Right. Um, anywhere you got a flat service. So you're telling me that you can take me from being a driver to being a driver? And a putter. And a putter. Yeah, see, I had someone <laughs> say, what can you do for my drive? And I said, I can call you Uber, but since you're already a driver, you already have that, you know. Well, I mean, I, I imagine <laughs> if I learn the, the basics yeah, of the, the putt, basics. I could probably hit it down the fairway pretty well. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that's the easy part. It's, you know, it's, it's, the, it's the drive finesse. for show and it's the putt for dough. Right. It's about, we can get you on the green, but what do you do after you get to the green? Right. You have to get in that little itty bitty little hole within a certain amount of strokes. Right. And by using our products, you're getting that practice. Awesome. And you will find, I have uh, some golfer friends that have used it. And one of them says, this is, I've looked for a device like this for my entire life. Right. He's taken strokes off his game. People are going like, what are you doing? So it's a self advertising thing. When people see what you're doing, you're going to say, oh, I have this, Delta putt device and I'm practicing and they're like, really? That's awesome. So, now I can tell you're passionate about the game of golf. Give me a little bit of history that you've got in this realm. What got you into golf? Well, really, it's kind of funny. I don't play golf. Okay. So there's, there's the thing, but. Ooh, don't tell anybody. Yeah, don't well, that's all right. I, no, I tell people because you don't have to be a golfer to get started. Okay. We all have to start somewhere, right? Right. So I will play golf eventually, but right now, so I'm practicing my putting. So okay. my friend Dave that invented it, I know him and his wife for years, and I've seen the device, and I looked at it, and I thought, this is pretty cool. He sent me some. Okay. So I showed them to my golf friends. I said, hey, try this out. Yeah. See what you think. Give me your feedback. So over the last two years, I've been giving this away to different people okay. for like a week at a nice. time. Uh, I've given it to a couple of high school golf teams. Right. They've seen an improvement within a couple of weeks. Okay. So once again, it's all, how are you going to improve your game unless you practice? Right you're not going to get better. Right. So it's all about the practice. Everyone that's used it, we're working with a couple of major corporations. Okay. Uh, we've signed a contract with one. The first thing he did is he saw that and he goes, it's amazing how simple things can be so effective. Right, right. And when you have sure. someone that's a major player in the golf industry saying that it's effective, I mean, immediately, that's the immediate feedback we get. They'll right. hit it a couple of times. They're like, oh my gosh, I know immediately when I hit the puck with my putter, what's going to happen. Yeah. And it's the immediate feedback from your stroke right. is what the golfers are looking right. for. Absolutely. And so, you know, it's just like any other business. You see an opportunity, you look at it, you try it, and away you go. And what's really interesting is that we're at one side of Interex. When I look at the other side, what's on the floor over there? Yeah, there's, there's a putter. There's, there's a Delta putt because they, they bought a couple and they okay. have them out there with some putters so that when people come in, they can putt. Oh, I love it. Uh, one of the major contracts we've signed, they have them in their office with putters so when people come in they putt for a couple minutes right. and then they go into their meeting right yeah they so get it's the like little... a de-stressor yeah yeah right? no, that's yeah. a great idea i mean i could see i could see something like this in a doctor's office because you know they're waiting you right. know all, any any place you're waiting you it would make sense for something like that yes. so i would love to get personal for just a minute so i love okay. to ask like a bonus question all right so i always love those today in dallas it's a rainy day uh, i don't know when you're watching this but it's rainy today and I want to know kind of what your preference would be on a rainy day. Are you a rainy day guy who's like a Netflix binge watcher, a book reader, or like kick your feet up, pet your dog, just chill out? Like what's your preference on a rainy day? Or on a rainy else? day, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to turn off the alarm. Okay. I'm going to pull up that blanket. Ah. And I'm going to sleep for like an extra half hour. There you go. If you mentioned pets. You know, pets get used to eating at a certain time. Right. If I pull it up, my cat's going to be out there going like, hey, feed me, feed me. I don't care right, what time right, it is, feed right. me. Right, 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 yep. And then I just kind of kind of hang out and surf a little bit, read a book. I'm trying to get more into reading books. Okay. And then as soon as it clears up, it, when it does, it's like, let's get outside and, and enjoy ourselves. Right. I'll throw this down after a little while and because it's not all about work. Sure. You know, I can tell my wife, well, I'm going to be putting around for a little bit. There right? you go. Get it? There you go. I love it. So, and this is totally something you could do on a rainy day. Absolutely. Oh, exactly. It's perfect for when people go, well, it's not golf season yet. I had someone in Michigan and it's still snowing. It's like, that's what this is for. It's not snowing in your house, hopefully. Exactly. Your house. Your... <laughs> if it is, please call me because that, that's unusual. Yeah. Yeah. You have people that can help. <laughs> right. But think outside of the box when and where you can use this. We're, we're talking with a, another company that does uh, men's haircuts. Oh, yeah. And they're always looking for something to do, a game of chance. Okay. And this is set up like a shuffleboard. Yeah. And so he wants to put like free haircut. You get three chances. You land it in a certain circle. Okay. But once again, like you mentioned, yeah. they're, they're waiting. 
Right. So you're talking about gamification, which everyone is about these right, days. Right, right. You can create a game out of this with your friends, with your family. I have some people that have some golfers in their family, so the kids are playing with this during this yeah. uh, virtual training time. Okay. So it, endless possibilities. So Paul, I know you're a small business owner, entrepreneur. You know, as we're closing this out today, do you have any words of wisdom, anything you'd want to share with my audience? I would. It's the entrepreneur. It's the, hey, I see something. It's interesting. Take a look at it. Just don't say, oh, it's not going to happen for me. And show it to a few friends and see what your friends think. Ask them, what do you think of this? Right. Some will be game changers like this. Some will be duds. But until right. you actually get out there and ask someone or right. try it or, you know, do something. Right. You'll never know because a lot of people will do nothing. Right. And doing nothing is not the way to go. What call to action is like, like I called Dave and I said, hey, Dave, that's pretty cool. Can I buy one or get right. one and try it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, you know, he goes, yeah, I'll send you one. Okay. You know, bought me a little putter, took it to a few friends. Nice. But it's the actual doing something with right. an idea, a product. You know, I mean, you're a realtor. If you just sat there and never showed someone a house. <laughs> right. I, would, I wouldn't be in business very long, would I? Exactly. Right, we right. all... As for either business owners, entrepreneurs, or for aspiring business owners, right. need to take a chance. I agree. Some will work, some won't. So take action is what I'm hearing, and yep. it sounds like take turn action. over those stones. Yep, turn them over, give it a shot. If it appeals to you, take a look at it. Especially now with the internet and all that kind of stuff, you go online, you can find all about it, right. and just take that step. You'd be surprised how easy it is to be the next you know, Shark Tank person. You never know. I absolutely love it, Paul. Thank you for showing this to us today. Now, how can somebody get in touch with you if they want to buy this or collaborate around this with you? The easiest way is pretty simple, iputtbetter.com. I came up with the name because I'm driving home going like, if I were to create a company as a golfer, what would I want to do? I would want to putt better. There you go. iputtbetter.com. Um, I'm at VentureX in Frisco, Texas, so you can always call VentureX in Frisco, Texas. They know me. Um, just hit me up. You know, um, you can also hit my email, iputbetter at gmail.com. So it's all about iputbetter. There you go. You heard it from here. So, Paul, thank you so much for your time. Yeah, appreciate it. I think thanks for asking me to come aboard. This has been fun. Yay. Well, I've got more places to go and yep. people to talk to, but we'll, we'll see each other around yep. sometime. Oh, we will. All right, Paul. All right.